back in the wild again. Three wolves settling into their new home in a pocket of woodland near Burnfoot in Donegal. Wild Ireland is the realisation of a childhood dream for solicitor and zoologist Killian McLaughlin. This all started in my back garden at home. Uh, every waif or stray or injured animal uh, would inevitably end up in our back garden and I would work and uh, rehabilitate them and get them back into the wild. And uh, some of them couldn't go back to the wild, so in my back garden is where they stayed. And then I wanted to get, give them more space and replicate the wild. If they have to stay in captivity, well then let's make captivity a, a good place for them where they can act like, you know, act like a wolf or act like a bear. And Apart from the monkeys, all the wild animals here were once native to Ireland and all of them have been rescued from dangerous or unsuitable situations. In fact, one of the monkeys was found wandering Paris wearing a nappy. Many of these animals find themselves in horrendous uh, conditions, like our bears did in Lithuania. They were kept in a concrete cell with iron bars on the front and they were exploited as a tourist attraction, as a little extra to encourage people to come into the museum that they were housed in. What do you hope people will learn from here? So hopefully when people leave the park, they'll realise the, the diversity of wildlife that once was in Ireland. And hopefully they'll realise that, when, that this, is an, this is our treasure, our, our wilderness is our treasure. And the little wilderness that we have left should be preserved.